Hello friends, welcome to our channel Logic Computer Institute. In this section, we will learn about basic organization of computer systems. Then all types of computer follow the same basic logical structure and perform the following 5 basic operations for converting raw input data into information useful to their users. Then first is take input. The process of entering data and instruction into the computer systems. Then second is store data. Saving data and instructions so that they are available for processing as and when required. Third, processing data. Performing arithmetic and logical operation on data in order to convert them into useful informations. Then four, Output information, the process of producing useful information or result for the users, such as a printed report or visual re display. Fifth one, control the workflow, direct the manner and sequence in which all the above operations are performed. These are the five basic operations which are performed for converting raw input data into the useful information so we see the diagram this is a basic organization of computer systems there are number of units input units then central processing unit output units so we see the one by one so input unit in input unit by using input unit, the data and instructions must enter a computer system before the computer can perform any operations on the supplied data. The data and instruction enter a computer through an input unit in a form that depend upon the input device used, such as keyboard, mouse, scanner are the input devices used with computer systems. Then Next is CPU. CPU means Central Processing Unit. CPU is uh, considered as the brain of the computer. CPU performs all type of data processing operations. It stores data, intermediate result and instructions. It controls the operation of all parts of computer. And CPU itself has following three components. These are First is ALU means arithmetic logic unit. This unit consists of two subsection, namely first is arithmetic section and second is logic sections. In arithmetic sections, the function of arithmetic sections is to perform arithmetic operations like addition, subtraction, multiplication and division. All complex operations are done by making a repetitive use of above operations then second one is logical section the function of logical section is to perform logic operation such as comparing selecting matching and merging of data these are function of alu unit then second of cpu second part of cpu that is memory unit in memory unit, data and instruction entered in a computer system through the input unit have to be stored inside the memory unit before actual processing start. This unit can store instruction data and intermediate result. This unit supplies information to the other unit of the computer when required. It is also known as internal storage or main memory. Then next control unit the control unit of computer cpu act as the central nervous system for all other components of the computer this unit controls the operation of all parts of computer but does not carry out any actual data processing operations the function of this unit are it is responsible for controlling the transfer of data and instruction among the other unit of computer. Then second, it manages and coordinates all the units of the computer. Third one, 
it obtains the instruction from the memory interprets them and directs the operation of the computer then fourth one it communicates with the input output devices for transfer of data or result from the storage and fifth one is it does not process or store data this is a control unit then last one is output unit output unit consists of devices with the help of which we get the information from computer this unit is a link between computer and users output devices translate the computer's output into the form of understandable by the user it gives the final result to the user so we see the diagram this is a diagram of basic computer organization this is a input unit which input the data to the computer systems then this is a control unit which control the all the operation of the whole computer systems this is a arithmetic and logic unit in which arithmetic operations such as ad addition subtraction multiplication divisions and logical operation such as comparing matching such operations are performed in this unit the central processing unit are mainly divided into three units that is arithmetic control unit and storage unit and this is the output unit which gives the result or informations these are the basic operation of the computer systems thank you and subscribe our channel logic computer institute for more videos